video <laughs> i am your brother don't you worry how are you brother yeah. how are you i am doing great what about you great 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 fantastic doing fantastic where are you calling from i am calling from qatar qatar but basically qatar. i but yeah, basically I, i am from indian state of jharkhand i tranchi tranchi jharkhand dhoni mahendra singh dhoni you are my yes yes <laughs> neighbor of my <laughs> but i will not tell that he is my neighbor <laughs> yes yes he is he your neighbor is he your neighbor before he was my neighbor because i yeah. was uh, i used to live uh, Five four kilometer away from his home, but right now I am big far, like twenty kilometer far away from his home. So you go away, or he go away from you? Both we we went away. First he <laughs> went away from our home, and after that I moved from my home. Yes, that's good for health. That's good for our health. <laughs> yeah, and because health. before before he used to live in a government quarter, but uh, in I think. Uh, 2020 World Cup when India won, then the Jharkhand government gave him a good flight, you know, a uh, good villa. Yeah, he deserves it. You know, he worked yeah, very yeah, hard. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. For, yes, yes, he, he deserves. Yes, unique talent. Like a yes, fantastic. Yeah. <laughs> in 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 Indian history, nobody can change him. Yes, 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 yes. He is a remarkable, <laughs> splendid. Yes. you know yeah it's, it's, yeah it's a splendid job you know yeah i'm a big fan of mr mahendra singh dhoni me too me too sir and virat yeah. kohli and mahendra singh dhoni they are legend every indian you know? is a big fan of mahendra singh dhoni i love virat kohli i think he is a fantastic guy as well no. as i i also love virat kohli somebody uh, everybody when i play cricket somebody say me that you are playing as a virat kohli but i don't play like a virat kohli but all of my colleagues say me that you play very well why not you can you can why not sir why not because i love, why i love virat kohli i love his aggression i love i really don't yeah, like yeah. the play yeah but the way he play the, you know putting his 200% in the ground on the field yeah. and the, i love the way but, you know he aggress on the opponent Opponent. Yeah, yeah but, but I think apart from the cricket, when he lives outside, he is very calm guy. In the field, yes. only he becomes aggressive. Yeah, it's a good. Yeah, it's a good for it, it, yeah, yeah. It's a good for cricket and it's good for audience. When when cricketer will not uh, will be not aggressive in the field, audience will cannot enjoy the cricket. Yes. Yeah. But if you are. Not- Race you have you gonna won? Have you gonna win the yes. battle? Yes. Playing is not a game; it's a battle that we have to win the battle anyhow. Yeah. We have to. Anyhow. Yeah. Yeah, we are the playing for proud of India, brother. It's yeah, not yeah. just a, it's proud for India. Yes. You know, yes. To win, to win the each and every game. Yes. Yes. Anyway, that's uh, that's uh, that's a part of life. That's a part of the game. Tell me about yourself, yeah. Mr. Dhanis. Uh, as you know my name is mohammad danis and yes. basically i am from india but i have been living here since 2017 and i am yeah i am an accountant working with finance company here in qatar i see i see that's great how long have you been living in qatar 2 uh, year i have i have been living here for 4 years for 4 years for 4 yes. years so how's yeah. your job in qatar are you enjoying life Yeah, I am enjoying, and uh, yeah, life is very good here. Mashallah, Mashallah, Mashallah. That's great. So today is your leave or what? Yeah, today is my leave. Basically, I have two leave: Friday and Saturday. Friday and Saturday. Why? You are you are working Because in the government sector. Yeah, it uh, it is not a fully government, but is a half government. I can say like semi government. Semi government. Yeah. Yeah, because well, we that, follow the government rule. You we follow the government rule. So each and yeah. whenever the government, they you know you yeah, got yeah. each and every to the hey, government. Each and every facility. Like uh, uh, here in Qatar, we have only four holy holidays in a year. Like Eid, Bakrid, National 
uh, day and uh, sport day only four but apart from these four if government uh, give any uh, off additional then we also get i see i see that's yeah. great great so what you do what you do on your spare time mr dani like you are spare day today and yesterday also you had a spare day what you did basically before corona uh, we wished uh, we used to play cricket outside we used to go outside for the fun but as corona happened so we mm-hmm. were not allowed to go outside but this time things are being changed so mm-hmm. before two days ago a uh, circulation came that now you are allowed to go but we have to maintain our distance and everything yeah. so it, this time basically i used to live in a, a home and playing with friends in our home and watching movie watching your videos <laughs> yes, <laughs> reading yes. books yes 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 i see are you enjoying my videos brother yes yes definitely everybody enjoying on youtube your videos i see not I see, only that. me everybody is enjoying that's why yes. i thought i should talk to you i saw there uh, there were uh, five six youtuber as doing same as you are talking with all over the world so i thought let me talk first with you but this week things are being changed like uh, corona is decreasing so mm-hmm. now everybody is going vacation mm-hmm, i see from my office uh, like uh, four to six guys going vacation this week that's why i was busy this week so mm-hmm. that's why i couldn't call you last week i mailed you that i want to talk to you but i used to come very late from the office that's why i see what is you know uh, the temperature i i have heard that people told me the temperature is very high right now in very Gulf very Gulf. very high very high without ac anywhere you cannot live like in the kitchen you need ac in the car you need ac in office you need ac yeah temperature is very high yeah outside you temperature, temperature nowadays it's uh, 46 47 but it goes as highest as 50 degree more oh my god oh my god this is yeah. unbearable 50 degree yeah. 40 unbearable for human body you know yes yes go ahead go ahead tell me what's going on in your life what's going on in your life uh as is well not uh, anything difference because uh, since four year i have been living here so my routine is same yes, uh, yes, in right. the morning i go duty and come back from duty sometimes i go play football and cricket and sometimes i go park for jogging like that because i love jogging exercise i see yeah. i see these are the things and right now i am watching your video reading books Mm, that's great. That's great. This is the that's life. Good, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> did you take the? Did you tell me about you? Did you take the vaccine? Yeah, I. Yeah, I took my first vaccine. I think mm. uh, last last month. So this yeah. uh, this month this month I have to take another one. So two doses. Two doses. Yeah. What is the duration between first to second dose? because i took uh, moderna vaccine so i have to take after 28 days but uh, there are in qatar three different doses so it depends which doses are you taking there is astrazeneca doses uh, uh-huh. uh, it uh, they give after 2 months and after after yeah. yeah yeah 2 months 2 month duration in between yeah Part in between it. should be 2 month duration Yes, yes. I One see. of my brothers here uh, live. Uh, he lives with me, so he took uh, before me. But I will be vaccinated before him because there is only twenty-eight days uh, gap in between two, mm-hmm. and yes. he has uh, he has two months uh, between two doses. So he took first, but I will be vaccinated before him. Yeah, that's great. That's great, Marshal. I think yeah. all Qatar is vaccinated. all qatari yeah, and local inshallah people. very soon very soon qatar will be vaccinated fully because nowadays we are reaching more than 90 90% are people vaccinated here you are eligible to travel in india 
right now yeah i am eligible because two days ago a news came that those who who are vaccinated with two doses they can go and come back before if you want to go before uh, two days ago uh, before uh, after coming from the india you will have to stay in the quarantine center for the 14 days but now yeah but yeah. now those who are vaccinated can go in india and come back without uh, quarantine but how would how would government know how how would you know uh, the airport uh, uh, people know that you are vaccinated or no how would they know yes i will tell yeah. you there is a application yeah. name etras there is everything mentioned when yeah. you got positive there is mention when you took your first dose there is mention in your application on our mobile there is application name etras when first corona came here in qatar that time qatar built application yeah. uh, from yeah. the support of the technical staff this is the very good uh, there everything is recorded first yeah. Yeah. when there is four four line like uh, if you are not positive your etras application will show you green if you are yes. positive then your etras will show you red if you right. have to stay in quarantine then it will show gray and yes. if you are suspected if you go uh, hospital and the doctor took your sample for the corona test until your mm -hmm. corona test not come your application will show suspected be in the room that's mean it will show yellow so yes, this yes, is a very ma. good thing so i was positive before 6 month i so, see <laughs> first time my etras was green when i went hospital then they made my etras gray so I that see. time i was gray and next morning it was red it means you are positive now and what is the benefit of this application you cannot go anywhere like in the mall or hospital even office you cannot go there is a security in our office first you will have to show him your etras application from your mobile that you are green you are eligible to go inside or go anywhere if you have suspected and positive so anybody can catch you even you cannot go pray in the mocks there is a security in the mocks also you cannot go without mobile yes 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 i see when okay when... Uh, let me know one thing because i never asked this question from any indian if you are positive let's say not you if anybody is positive and yes. he knows only that he is positive so he can go anywhere in india people will not uh, catch him pardon me sir pardon me pardon me please okay if anybody is positive yes first first if he goes to medical store or hospital for the corona test and he came yes. back from the hospital next day or after 14 hours 15 hours when uh, when result comes okay that time mm -hmm. for example he is no positive so he can go anywhere no problem yeah he can go anywhere can go anywhere but after uh, report government know the medical staff know that he is positive for he is a positive so he you know he put 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 that person into the quarantine for 14 into the quarantine yeah yeah compulsory if the government don't allow them to travel or outing in nearby with the local people in near the area he has to go yeah. for the quarantine for the 14 days yeah, yeah. absolutely yes sir yes sir and Before i want to, to yeah, yeah yeah go ahead yeah please uh -huh. go ahead what about the 2022 world cup in qatar what's going on yeah yeah qatar is going to qatar is going to held next year fifa world cup so everything is prepared now everything is fully uh, because uh, this corona time some work uh, has been stuck uh, because of the corona so now time uh, inshallah next next year qatar will held 2022 fifa world cup do you think they can they can help the 2022 world cup yes qatar absolutely did? qatar yeah qatar deserves the best qatar deserves but japan japan they stopped you know last uh, asian olympic or something just they 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 said that they you know they closed they don't want to do something because of the covid 19 yeah but uh, you know qatar is a very small country and 
Qatar can control very easily because population is no more uh, here, like India, mm -hmm. like uh, uh, China, and any other country which has more population. Qatar is uh, only 3 billion people. So it, it can easily control any uh, disease or anything happens in Qatar. 3 billion or 3 million? 3 million only. Yeah, I, I, thought, I, I have heard that 3 billion, you said 3 billion. Maybe I, 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 I said 3 billion, but it's 3 million. Yeah, 3 million is not that Two, much amount. 2.9 or something approximately 3 million. So it's not that much uh, people. It's a very small yeah. amount. It's yeah. very small amount. It has only a small country. Yes, 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 I see. And Qatar has more, more money. That's Qatar why I think... Natural resource and rich with gas, Qatar. Yeah, and rich with gas. Natural yeah. gas. Um, yes. More than any other country in the Gulf. More than any other country yes. in the Gulf. More than Venezuela, Russia and America. Qatar has a more yeah. natural gas. Yeah. Yes, yes, I see, I see. Venezuela then, condition is not good these days. People are yeah. not getting any gas or petrol there because some days but I was watching one. People are not get, getting their benefits, their natural resource benefits. Yes, Likewise, yes. All Gulf countries are getting benefits. Venezuela is not getting that much benefit. I, maybe the reason behind the corruption. Maybe the main reason behind the corruption, Mr. Dani. Yeah. Corruption, I think. I have yeah, no idea. Yeah, that, they, yeah, also I don't have that much idea, but uh, I heard that there is very much corruption in Venezuela. And, you know, uh, it takes lots of money to extract, exact, you know, the oil. Because, they, you know, their land is fully occupied with, you know, stone. But in yes. what happened in... In the Gulf countries, there is a sand. You can easily extract uh, the oil from the field. It doesn't take yeah. too much amount. But in America, in Venezuela, it takes lots of money to extract the oil from the land. Yes. You know, yeah. the surface is very strong. The surface is very strong. But in a Gulf country, the surface is very, you know, very, uh, like a very, uh, what, what we call, very normal very surface. It's very easy for them to companies to extract the oil and rich quality oil, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. Anyway, this is the different thing. Tell me, tell me something about yourself. 